Hello everybody, welcome to digital painting and photography channel. This is Toshiyagi from beautiful little island Okinawa, Japan. I'm a photographer and shot this image long time ago. 4x5 black and white image. Mushroom. I got this black and white image and uh, mm. normal lighting for food backlit. That's showing nice form of the foods usually well i got this image and uh, i have this ai colored image by adobe photoshop neural filter that's pretty interesting colors i like that not just same kind of mushroom colors it's yeah there is many different mushrooms i think and also I have this pencil drawing type image used filter called find edges as always. And I'm going to try to find out something interesting image from these images. Well, let's get started. Okay, change blend mode of this pencil drawing type image. Let's see what's the interesting image. Nice pencil drawing type image, and I like express something like illustration type image. Nice saddle colors. Yeah, how about this tone? Luminosity. Half tone. Well, make as a base image. Okay, this image. Luminosity of this pencil drawing type image. Make group and uh, duplicate this group. Then this luminosity effect image is gonna be the base image. Okay, now let me see other effects like uh, overlay. Give it pretty nice contrast like this maybe. Well, let me fix this image, one layer. Okay, flatten this image. Then uh, let me see, over this luminosity effect image, change blend mode to... Color is dark on colors of this luminosity effect image. But color burn needs much more dark colors. Pen light shows more shadow side density. Now I like, yeah, color burn. I think I like that. Okay, color burn. Because linear burn is too dark on shadow side. Yeah, I want to see a little more details around here. Okay, this time I want to choose color burn max. Okay, now I want to add white layer over this. Fill this layer with white and uh, make mask. Then I'm gonna reveal this image with drawing to evolve. Okay, then uh, I want to see this pencil drawing type image over this white layer. So I duplicate this pencil drawing type image, then move up. Now change blend mode to darken. Alright, then uh, just leave it this and reveal this white layer. Okay, brushes evolve, size pretty big, and opacity is pretty thin. We are mm, about 10, 20. Okay, let's see. Reveal this white layer with the real thin color first, I mean uh, opacity, so 
you gotta do a couple times to get different opacity. Okay. Hmm. Reveal this mask pretty good now. We see the sharp image on foreground and colors nice. The background is less color and we see the yeah window frames. Alright. Now I want to add, let's see, over this white layer. Add layer for gradation color. And uh, add mask. Invert this mask. Okay. Now I want to add some colors. Like, let's see, this window, window frame. Or, let's see, brushes evolve. make a little window and uh, add color with airbrushing to soft brush. Now color is mm, light blue. Okay, pretty nice. And uh, just touch. Okay. And add frame, window frame again. Okay, add. I can fix the window shape later on, so. I'm going to just get paint with soft brush. A little bit shabby look, dark green. Okay, let me see, fix this shape. Okay, now light side of the frame, make a little window. Okay, this is a little bit light image. Okay, again, fix this window. Alright, very nice. Let me fix here. Okay, now go for foreground. Let me see, and window. Okay, fix window later. Now add color. Okay. Let me see, fix window and color. Again, fix a little window again.
Okay, let me see. They have some different colors on these mushrooms. Okay, make window first. Maybe I should... Okay, I'm gonna add another gradation color layer because it effect... uh, it's gonna affect the window of the little shape ne next to each other. So add gradation color layer. Okay, got mask, invert this mask. Now I'm gonna open this, open little window here. Let's see, add color. Now, fix this window. Okay, now we add here, hmm, let's see, make window first. Okay, add color. All right, very much interesting. Let me see, touch up some overall image. About the shadow area is different gradation color layer two. Oh, layer one, okay. Now let me fix this. Right, I'm gonna open window here again and add color. X window. Let me check overall image that uh, I think this area mushroom is too much yellowish. So let me see if I can change. Let's see if I add some reddish color maybe. Okay, base image overlay just under this white layer add layer for color then change blend mode to color and add some reddish tone with the soft brush let me see if i can tone down this yellowish color add some red and uh, blue Just complementary color over this to tone down yellowish color, but it's not interesting, huh? 
That's too much. Just all the mushroom color is the same. So maybe just leave this, some of them. So let me erase this too much, I think. And uh, I add colors already. Okay, I'm going to touch up some colors, overall image. Just leave this red color in, um, around here. Then uh, maybe add some more. Okay, right here. Add color of this shadow area. Maybe more touch reddish. And make window okay now pretty much interesting yeah okay then now uh, shadow area okay mm. well let me see now about this pencil drawing type image I'm going to change blend mode darken to color burn yeah color burn max I think pretty much done. Let me see. All right. Now from this original image, I start with this black and white image, then change to colorized um, Adobe Photoshop neural filter to get this colorized image. Pretty interesting color. And I add pencil drawing type image, change blend mode to luminosity to get this real saddle colors this is the base image then I change blend mode luminosity to overlay effect to get one layer and and over this image change blend mode to color burn to get so much dark colors then add white layer with mask white layer with mask this shows this much and add two gradation colors one overall image and two inside of the mushrooms and background that's two gradation colors with brush texture then I change some yellowish mushroom color and color blend mode is color to get this a little bit warm tone warm colors then last thing pencil drawing type image blend mode change to color burn to add this little lines well that's it for today and uh, thank you for watching my video I really appreciate for you guys support and uh, pretty much illustration type image. I hope you're gonna find some idea for your creative work and uh, you guys have a nice day and see you next time. Bye now. Ciao. Good day.